Good day, lords and ladies of the internet. I am your host, the Parafox Archangel, the English gentleman of the internet, and I welcome you back to the gentleman's fancy place in Oxygen Not Included, where we have a few things we need to get ready today. What those things are, I can't think of immediately, and I have no idea what they would be. First off, we might want to get into there. That seems like a good thing to start with. What else do we need? We need a refinery. That's it. So, where's the refinery? Refinement. Oil refinery. No, metal refinery. That's what we need. How are we going to get this metal refinery? Eh. We just got to figure out a place we want to put it. Frankly, we could put it up here. Wouldn't be the worst idea. Worst of ideas. We are currently researching temperature modulation, so we can turn these all into temperature pads, so that we hopefully can keep this in here as cold air eventually, so that we can grow our sleep wheat and get super food. Not that we actually have a problem with food whatsoever. Mm. Gosman needs a goddamn break. According to up here, having the highest stress of 93% with the next person having 8. Gosmund, you need a goddamn break, clearly. But yeah, most importantly, we need the metal refinery. And we also need to figure out where I'm going to put such a thing. Wow, and that's actually quite hot water. There. That can be a, me that can be a metal refinery. Seems to work. Seems to work alright. We just need people to build it now. Good. Good. All is good. Then we can make some refined metal and have the... And stop having the thing overflowing with power. Or the power overflowing, even. Because that will eat into our resources quite a... Where did all my coal go? Thank you. Where'd all, my, where'd all my copper go, even? Right. We are almost out of algae, as well. So, we need to start digging into this. Oh, you're another thing that'll need to be wrangled eventually. But currently, you're not. there's nothing up there for you to eat that I properly care about. Apart from the algae over there, which you better not start eating. Otherwise, we're gonna show you what death is. Yeah... We need this metal refinery pretty quickly. Uh, Narbong, if you could, please, I'd be most grateful. Six tons of algae. Oh, that suddenly changed to a lot from 100 kilograms, which it was saying earlier. So, can I actually make some of this then? I could make some of that. I just don't have any real grain or sources of it either. Man, I need a new, I need another wheezewort. Meaning I'm probably going to need to dig into there eventually. We finished our temperature modulation. Perfect. Right. Now what do we want to do? We want... I don't know. Something. Something that we can use and would be nice. You know what? Give me the... Stop researching into the... What's it called? Conveyor belt system. That's what it's called. Yeah, seriously, what's with all the natural gas down here? What is causing this natural gas? Especially the fact there's 2,000 odd grams of the stuff. Right. Well, we have our insulated tiles. So, let's try and make them all up here. And see if that actually will make a difference. You're almost there, guys. Just a little more and you can- and you'll finish building the... Thing. Oh, we've actually got oxygen down here. I'm going to assume that's due to the algae terrarium. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm not going to complain about that. Carbon down there is to left to be desired. This is all natural gas for some reason, so yeah. Really don't know what's with all the natural gas around the place, if I'm fully honest. That sounds like a new employee! 
Welcome to the Gentleman's Manor. Are any of you actually worth my time? Hmm. The answer's no. I'm just looking at you guys now, and the answer's no. For some reason, you all want to be ranchers with no ability to ranch. You might be a decent cook, but we have no need for food right now. So I'm sorry, but all of you can get lost. Let's hope those insulated tire tiles actually work. What's that do to decor, by the way? Insulated tiles reduce decor. Thought it might. Negative decor, negative, negative, plus. And you're a big plus. Right. I wouldn't actually mind if people could fix the wires, too. I mean, it's not that big a thing, is it? Still want to know what's with all the natural gas everywhere. Oh, a wire broke. A critical wire broke. Can someone fix that critical wire? I hate every single one of you. As you are all completely useless. Aren't you? Alright. So, cause I have to do this myself. Nine, nine, nine. At this point, probably nine. Where's some, where's some of the other ones? Nine. Get on it. Especially as one of those is your oxygen, you morons. Uh, what am I always dealing with when I'm dealing with you idiots? It's always so stupid. So much stupid. It's always around the place. You're almost done. Well, that's an interesting few bits of water for some reason. I guess I'm letting out some of the water. Huh. That's irritating. Especially as I can't actually do anything about it. We just gotta mop it up. Water, water everywhere, and too much to bloody drink. Well, as it seems to have stopped leaking now, at least, things might be a little better. But we're gonna have to see once we crack open that bit over there. Why are you using iron ore for that, if you don't mind my asking? It should not be fucking iron ore. It should be copper! Where's my copper? Why do I have so little copper left? Well, probably because I'm making this. That's why. Well, at least we've got all the water mopped up now. Well, almost. Well enough for it not to matter. To fix the wires too, that is good. Still a bunch of water down here to mop up. Come on, there's just what? Yes! Thank you! Now we can start producing the refined metal. Can't we? Right? Yes. Yes, we can. We're gonna let one of the farmers do it, are we? Yep, sure. Okay, why not? Don't worry, wires. We're gonna get you your refined me wires soon. If you don't mind me asking. Made a mess. Why did you make a bloody mess? You, why are you making messes? Clean all that up now. Um, you're allowed to clear the toilet, you know. Might be an idea. Good. About time. Also, clear up that muck, that mess, please. Alright, now our actual problem is actual power consumption, because this thing uses a lot. And we don't have much to work with, frankly. You know what? This seems a little... off. But I think it's a necessary thing we might want to do. Which is, we put you there. We put the gas filter there. We have a gas vent there. We have the power there. And a gas bridge. And a more pumping into there. Where we have the gas 
pump there. And then we do a little bit of that. But then we need power on top of it, unfortunately, because everything needs bloody power. I did not do that movement. I went straight across. Screw you. Alright, at least the, at the, the right gas appears to be in here now. Yeah, the coal just doesn't seem to produce enough power. So why we need to start pumping cup gas into the into the natural gas which is all spread across down here for some reason into there. Narbong, wake up. We need you to build things. And building things does not involve getting up slying sleepily on the job. How much conductive wire do we have? A little. Barely any. Basically not enough. Come on guys, it's almost finished. Come on guys, it's almost finished. Narbong, where the hell are you? Thank you, Narbong. You're my favorite, Narbong. You get stuff done. It is a literal case of we only need to do it until, well... You know what? Cancel you. And then we're, we're gonna replace you with a regular one. We don't have enough. How do we not have enough? Okay. What do you want for me to be able to build this? A lot more iron, clearly. Or something along that line. Fine! Where do we find some iron? Is the temperature in here getting colder? Yes. Yes it is. Good. Eventually, it might get cold enough. Welcome to the Gentleman's Manor. Are any of you actually worth my time? Hmm? We got enough farmers. We don't need a cook. You got a lot of special abilities to you, especially the diver's lungs. But other than that, you're not the best. So I'm afraid, reject all of you. Narbong, build that thing. Wherever the hell you've got to. What does our decor look like right now? The bedrooms look pretty alright with... Ugh. Gosmond, I told you to get on the massage table. The massage table's still turned off. Okay, fine. So Ruby, get out the way and enable this building. Stop that. You don't need to do it every second. That is not how vomiting works. It does not happen every second. You don't have that much crap inside you. Stop it, Gosmond. Gosmond. Gosmond, stop it! You literally have vomited more than your, at your actual mass right now. You can stop, and you can prove to me you're not worth the what. You know what? You're not needed up there anymore, so Gosmond, if you would not mind redu reducing your scientist level. So you can stop being so arrogant in what you, in what you want. This place is a bit of a mess right now. Just a tad. Right, the wires that break immediately are the ones getting replaced. And someone fill these up with coal, please. We, it's not like we don't have enough. Now I know why none of these are getting powered. Because the fucking wire's dead. It's not the problem with the, the coal, it's the fucking wire. You know what, guys? I'm starting to think Ellie does need her own room. What does Ellie even do here? She's a researcher. Okay. Ellie, get in there. That's where you need to be that's where you belong. What's your problem? Temperature. What temperature is it? Quite hot. Why is it so hot? Is it co it's cuz of these things, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Getting pretty hot over there. Oh, that's a dead wire. That means a conductive wire right there, please. 
Yeah, the water from geysers seems exceptionally, well, hot. So that might be something I need to deal with. Oh, that's more dead wires over there. Oh, and an important dead wire up there. We will slowly, very slowly, replace all of the wires in this place. That is our main priority right now. But besides that, I said I'd try and get up into here, didn't I? Up into there. So, might as well try that. See how that works for you people. There, that's one set of conductive wire. Thank you, Narbonk. You are a blessing and a godsend. Temperature's definitely going down in this area down here. Do you produce decor? Yes, not as much as the the living briar, but you produce more than a dead briar. So, oh, ha, do we actually have? We only have the one wart, don't we? Yep. Right. Okay. That's another dead wire that we need to replace. As I say, they will all get replaced eventually. At least Marie and whatnot can actually start sleeping properly now. Right. There we go. Things are a little, well, problematic at the moment, but we will make do. We just need a lot more refined stuff. And I also need to figure out how I'm going to reduce the temperature in here. Because everything in there is exceedingly hot. Alright, why isn't the carbon skimmer working? Doesn't appear to be any water in there whatsoever. So, needs to do. Bottle up. Right there. Right now. Someone make the bottle thing, please. We need our carbon dioxide removal. Like now. Please. Alright, where's the dead wire? Considering nothing's working. Or is it we're is it that we're out of power? There's the dead wire. Uh, this is gonna take forever. Absolutely bleeding forever. Alright, can I disable this manual generator? As well, please? Because that does not need to be turned on. This thing, however. All the water. Right now. We need to start removing that carbon. Well, that's the sound of a new employee. Welcome the... No. No, I'm not even going to finish that line. The only one who might be worth anything is, is Hassan right here. And again, no. Bye-bye. Uh, we need people to move that so we have a chance at getting another wheezy wart or whatever the hell they're called. While at the same time hoping we don't crack open any chlorine. And that, because that stuff's not nice. Guys, we desperately need you to put water in there. So that we can have a hope of dealing with things. Right. I can set some new research. Cool. What do we want to research? I have absolutely no bleeding idea. So we're going to research transit tubes because why not? So. Where's the water? I need a lot more water in, in, quite, in a, quite a quick amount. Is there enough? Is that? Yeah, that's too much to sweep. You know what? Piping, piping. If we, for whatever reason, can create a liquid pump there, and can somehow transfer it all the way over to us, I need to stop. I need to get better at placing these damn things. Right, guys, I think I've prepared us one of our biggest archi biggest goals of architectural engineering. That being, well, move, and mine, and everything. Why are you dead? Broken wire. We can fix that. 
And a broken one there, too. Mm-hmm. These wires are getting broken way too much, you know? Although I do still have kind of plenty of the damn conductive wire or refined metal in order to make the conductive wire. Don't have any copper anymore, though. I'll probably get more from mining these bits out, possibly, a bit, maybe. <sighs> you know what? Dealing with these little munchkins is definitely hard. I'll grant it that. Why isn't the temperature going down? It's meant to be going down. Something tells me I need to encase the entire thing in this stuff. Right, if we do this, maybe it will get down. Where's Narbon? Where's our architect who's meant to be building things? Considering this thing's back online again, we kind of want the water. And also people to build the fucking wires. What are you all fucking doing? Other than sucking. Make the wires! I'm dealing with idiots. Idiots need guidance. And guidance is what I offer to the poor to the poor souls. Welcome to the Gentleman's Manor. Are any of you worth my time? Answer, no. I don't care how, what you've got, how good you are at it. We've got all the people we need right now. We just need them to do the right things. You're all utterly incompetent, aren't you? It's certainly starting to look that way. And oh, look. That thing's producing so much water, it's overfilling. It's as if I guessed that this would happen. So fill up the... Do we have a Wrangler yet? Yes, we do. Marie, you're now the rancher. Go catch all the animals. Well done, Marie. You look like a cute little cow cowgirl. Now go and pick stuff up. That... It's not a request, Marie. I want you to, to see you capture some of the animals. Huh. There's actually a thing over here, too. That's pretty interesting to know. Wonder, there's a weird amount of water... Weird amount of water around here. <sighs> well. It looks like we kind of got nothing done this episode. Because no one wants to do anything. Please. Can you all just do something useful? I see we're barely producing enough power. I'm probably going to have to capture into that natural gas geyser, aren't I? Tap into, even. That's the term I'm looking for. <sighs> how is the pipe fucking blocked? Tell me, how is that pipe fucking blocked? There is nothing blocking it! No matter what you try, that just keeps building up, doesn't it? So maybe you should stop trying and start building the thing that blocks it! Can everything stop breaking and everyone start working briefly for a bit? I mean, it's not the hardest request in the world, is it? I just want you to actually do your goddamn jobs. And that job being anything I ask of you. I'm sure we can eventually get this to work, can't we? Maybe. Um, Ellie? I'd like you to move. Ellie? I would like you to move. You! I would like you to move. Thank you. Narbong's now building everything. As he should be. All the time. We will unlock everything. That's a very big looking area though. The water in there just keeps on rising and rising. The oxygen is too high for stuff. So I feel I should actually just get an oxygen plant in there too. I like how if you leave ice long enough and the water in there long enough it freezes. We've got a bunch of critters just walking around in here now. That's good. We've got crit. We've got our little bits of. Ah, oh, that's actually adorable. Ah! 
That's actually freaking adorable. <laughs> Why did you make a mess? How did you make a mess? Why don't you just use the toilet if you're gonna make a mess? I kinda hate these idiots. And that's another mess for no good reason. Use the fucking toilet! Oh, you're stress vomiting. Never mind then. Why are you stress vomiting, Gosmond? And again, can you stop vomiting more than you actually have in your body? It just defies any laws of logic. I hate people. I really hate them. Stop it! GO TO BED, GOSMOND, AND STOP THROWING UP! YOU CANNOT THROW UP THAT MUCH, YOU DO NOT ACTUALLY HAVE THAT MUCH IN YOUR PHYSICAL BODY! STOP IT! Maybe if you go to bed, you wouldn't be so stressed, hey? Then you may stop throwing up, hey? Which would th then maybe stop making you fucking throw up more! IT'S AN INFINITE CHAIN, YOU REALIZE! <sighs> Welcome and bye bye I don't care any about any of you. <sighs> I've just got idiots to deal with. I've got more than enough idiots to deal with. In fact, our food supply is going down because of... Bloody wires dying. And me not realising either. Have I said how much I hate how much I hate these duplicates? Given how stupid they are and all that, and the fact the temperature just never seems to go down in this place, despite having the insulated tires and the wheezy wart constantly lowering the temperature and all that. Are, they, are these things too hot too now? Yes, they are. Yay! Everything's getting hotter around there. Yay! I'm gonna have to relocate all the bedrooms, aren't I? Probably. <sighs> Alright. Well. We've seen ranching in action actually for the first time today. That's cool. We're slowly fixing up this place. Slowly. We're dealing with idiots. Exceptionally slowly. I need to re-establish where I'm gonna get the water for that carbon skimmer. I need people to build this fucking thing. I need people to build these fucking things. I need people to do a lot of things which they refuse to bloody do! So! Everyone. I'd like to thank you all for welcome- for joining me in the gentleman's fancy place this week. We have a lot of things we need to fix up. A lot. However, I'm all out of time for this week. So everyone, I'd like to thank you all for watching. However, until the next time, it is now time for me to bid the all farewell, good day, and finally, good night.